Hey y'all, Coach Bradley coming at you to talk a little football training equipment, and today we're going to get after the Go Sports football throwing practice net. Let's get in. So first and foremost, let's go ahead and do a little walk around of this bad boy and see what you're getting when you pick this thing up. You got your nice little Go Sports carrying bag right there that uh, actually is pretty sturdy, man. Well put together. You got a couple stakes with a little bag there. Now your bottom base is gonna be made up of six metal pieces, all right? You got two pieces that snap together there, two pieces that snap together in the middle, and then two more pieces that snap together on that side. Then you're gonna have your composite posts, all right? Those are two pieces on each one. So there's four pieces to those composite posts. Then you're gonna get your nice netting right there with your three openings to throw your football. Now Go Sports gives you a couple different options when it comes to sizing for these things. Each of these is gonna have the three openings, but you can either get the six by six net, which is what we have here today, or you can also pick up a larger net, which is gonna be the eight by eight. Now each of your three openings is gonna be roughly 16 inches tall by 16 inches wide. And what I like about these top ones here, that's a throw right about at the numbers where you wanna hit a guy in the chest. And even the smaller one down here, a throw that's going to be about 32 inches off the ground up to 48 inches. So let's just take a little bit closer look at some of this netting right here. Now as a guy that uh, has a lot of these nets for both baseball and football, I got to say the quality seems pretty consistent with some of the other major brands that I've owned, including Champro and Bonet. Uh, and so I think if you take care of this stuff, you don't leave it out in the weather, you're going to do just fine and you're going to get years of use out of this thing. So let's go ahead and throw some footballs at this thing and see how it performs. Now to start out, we're not going to use any of these stakes on the front and we're going to see if it will stay up with us throwing footballs at it. So let's go ahead and see if we can put three balls in the three numbered holes like you're supposed to. One. Let's go ahead and intentionally miss one, throw it pretty hard, and let's see how much movement we get out of the bottom of this. So you can see how the pockets have nice deep nets so you can throw multiple footballs in them. And I'll tell you what, man, I've thrown a lot of footballs against this thing, and I don't really think you need to stake it down much. You know, the back uh, legs of this are much longer, so you will get a little bit of movement, but you really gotta be throwing some balls pretty dang hard for that thing to tip over. So if you want to get the most life out of this thing, I'm going to suggest that when you put it up, you leave it up for maybe days, possibly a couple weeks at a time, but don't leave this thing up year round, man, or it's going to get weathered and it's going to fall apart on you quicker than it should, because it should last you for quite a while. It only takes about 30 seconds to a minute to pull this thing down and put it in its bag. And when you want to pop it up again, it's going to take you about a minute to two and a half minutes max. So I've already done an unboxing and a setup video, but let's go ahead and show you just how fast this thing is to take down. So to close this thing out, I think the Go Sports football training net is a great tool for both budding young quarterbacks as well as guys that just want to get together and have some challenging times in their backyard. It's well constructed and should last you for quite a while if you take care of it. And it's for those reasons it gets a Coach Bradley thumbs up and I say, go out and get you one.